More and more pedestrians die on American roads last year than any year since 1981. And from 2010 to 2021, pedestrian deaths actually went up by 77%. And Florida was one of the three states to have the most deaths overall. Well, here to tell us about this growing problem, really, and refresh us on the laws on the road is Attorney Andrew Beloy. He's from Pike and Lustig Law Office here in our area. Andrew, thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. You're, we're seeing this rise. We're talking about these rise of deaths, the pedestrian accidents and deaths, and from a legal standpoint, uh, what are you seeing as the reason here? You know, thank you for having me, and what we've been seeing is just a, a lack of attentiveness to the roads, whether you're a pedestrian or a driver. Um, when you're driving, you need to make sure you watch out for pedestrians, you're off your phone, and you are paying attention to the road. And at the same time, pedestrians need to make sure that they are looking out at the drivers and ensuring that they are using the sidewalks. If there's no sidewalk, they can walk on the road, but they need to be walking with traffic, not into traffic. Um, so just making sure that you're attentive and being cautious and, and proactive when you're okay. walking and driving. Yeah, and what do viewers need to know right now when it comes to keeping themselves safe so on the roads this summer? A lot of us will be out and about on foot or in the car traveling to see our loved ones. Again, it, it just goes back to being attentive. Um, right. You know, it, it's not always just you. You have to watch out for the other drivers. You have to watch out for pedestrians who go into the middle of the road. And we've also been seeing a lot of uh, golf cart accidents mm. uh, where there's younger children, um, whether licensed or not, that they're driving in the western communities and there's children playing in the in the uh, different neighborhoods we want to make sure that everyone's safe and you're looking out for the vehicles so that way no one gets injured and sadly we also cover hit and runs in our area it happens uh, and sometimes we need to talk about the laws so that's what you're here for just to remind us a little bit about the legal standpoint there yes um, it is illegal to flee the scene of an accident if you are in an accident and there's any property damage or any injuries you must remain there on scene one of the biggest things is to just first make sure that you're okay if you're ever in an accident and if you're able to and in a safe manner pull off to the side of the road. Uh, additionally, if you flee the scene of an accident where there is an injury, uh, in 2014 the laws changed that you could end up to four years in prison for fleeing the scene of that accident. What would you tell viewers, you know, this question of it needs to stop, you know, when you hear something like that? It, it's always more dangerous to flee the scene of an accident and not only that it will cause more hardship for you and even the injured person potentially uh, what needs to happen is you just need to make sure that if you are in an accident you're safe you call 911 and you make sure that everyone is okay in your vehicle or wherever you are first and then you can go and check on other drivers or other parties involved. Mm -hmm. All right, Andrew Boy, that's all the time we have. But thank you so much for visiting our CBS 12 News studio to talk about pedestrian deaths in the rise right now in the United States.